Hello! Again, I am not in a car, and I am so happy. <laughs> Today, it, I'm not in a car because, not that I'm not working, but it's Sunday. So, I guess I am not working. And I just finished a quick workout in the gym, and I decided that it's a good time to come on and talk to you guys because I just struggled with something that I feel like many people struggle with, and just like little baby steps that just help me do a very simple thing like take care of myself and give me me time. So what am I talking about? This specific example is exercise, right? It's a very common thing where one, we know it's good for us mentally and physically, but a lot of us put it off. And why do we do that? Well, I'll tell you the reason why I do that many times is frankly I say, oh, I don't have enough time, I'm running late, and I just don't prioritize it, to be honest with you. Else, I'll kind of make a vague, like, idea of when I could exercise. Like, oh, maybe I'll exercise when the kids are napping. And then something will happen, and I'll be like, ah, I guess I'm not going to, I'm going to put that off. And that's the problem. With things like exercise or just self-care, like meditating, just getting that massage, going for that walk for you to improve yourself and give yourself time, it just goes like we don't prioritize it. We prioritize taking care of other people and anything that has to do with taking care of ourselves usually is the first thing to go. Am I right? And I'm here to tell you that you shouldn't do that. And I've been doing that for a long time and I am actively changing it. Of course, it's all a work in progress. Yesterday, to be honest with you, I did not exercise. When I even had the little post-it on my computer on my to-do that day <laughs> is exercise. And honestly, I was like checking off, I was taking off all the post-its that I had, was getting done. And I left that little exercise post-it on there because I was like, you know, out of all the things, you know, that I don't need to do that. And then, at the end of the day, I never got to it. And I felt, I was like, oh. And honestly, I fell asleep at my computer at like 10 o'clock. And in my head, I thought, you know, my energy level so down. If I had exercised, like I said I was going to do for myself, I probably would feel very differently right now. So, with anything, especially anything that has to do with your well-being and taking care of yourself, prioritize it. And when I say prioritize it, yeah, tell yourself that you should be doing it. But more importantly, what's been helping me is I put a specific time that I know I can get that done. And I put it on my schedule, just like anything else you put on your schedule, a doctor's appointment or whatnot, you don't miss it, right? So you think of it that way. It's not an option to miss. And it doesn't have to be a long time. Honestly, I came down here, ran a quick two miles. I'll be back in a half an hour, 30 minutes. If, and at one point, I was like, yeah, I don't really have time to go. What would I have done in the, those 30 minutes that I was upstairs? The kids are sleeping right now. I probably, oh yeah, I would have probably sent out a couple emails. But honestly, I'd be like, eh, I'd like look around, make myself a snack. <laughs> And then I'll be like, oh, and the kids would be up and I'd be like, oh, I missed my opportunity. But no, I was like, okay, I'm going to do this, I'm going to go down, I'm going to get done, and I'm going to feel good afterwards. And guess what? I feel good. And that's why I decided to make this quick video while I'm stretching and just say, it's worth it, you're worth it, prioritize it, and schedule it in your calendar, just like you would anything else that you would not miss and don't miss it and you will be so happy you did it but plus it will help all those around you too with whatever you're doing and when you prioritize your well-being and you're happier guess what everyone around you is happier too it's funny how that works so that's all i say whatever you've been putting off that will help you just you not just those around you, prioritize it, put it in, and do it today. That's it. That's my pep talk for Sunday. Have a great day, guys. Bye.